Welcome back, guys, to another. Blah, blah. Welcome back, guys, to another episode of Binding of Isaac. Today, we're gonna do another Samson run, in which that I hope to win, because I like to win. I actually recorded another episode today, uh, but like literally like half an hour ago. Um, but I closed down Skype. Like I, I had Skype open and the call and everything, and when I hung up. Um, it seems to have corrupted the file for whatever reason, um, which doesn't make a lot of sense, but it was a really good run. At, well, I mean, it was a failure run, but uh, we had technology and, and stuff, and it was kind of good, but it was kind of bad, so, you know, and stuff. I don't want to fight this boss, and he killed me anyways, so it didn't matter. Um, so yeah, that's upsetting, but whatever. Um, basically, all I did was, was talk about, like, you know, how I've... I've been uh, neglecting YouTube for the second time in like a month, um, and it's not for really any good reason. Like I don't have a good reason for it, um, other than the fact that uh, I just I, I don't know. I have like this this weird I don't know like state of thinking right now. I'm just kind of like oh I can either record or I can like go watch it. Wow, that's good. Or I can go watch like a stream or something, and then I end up watching the stream and not recording, and it's really bad. But I don't know. I'm really trying to get back on the YouTube wagon. Um, I, I definitely don't want YouTube to fail. I don't want you guys to feel like uh, you know, it's it's. You're neglecting them. Yes, I don't want you guys to feel like I'm neglecting you know YouTube or anything like that. Um, so you know, it just happens. Um, but I hope it. Or I hope for it not to happen anymore, or at least less, because uh, it does get really annoying for me. It does get really frustrating for me when I just kind of like stop recording for a certain amount of time. Like Sam and Max and stuff to finish that. Uh, Walking Dead 400 Days came out recently. Walking Dead 400 Days, Walking Dead DLC. So I will be doing that. Um, and I know it seems kind of silly. Like why would you start another series when you barely even finish the ones that you're doing right now? Um, I don't know, I just don't, I'm not, I'm not really ever in the mood to play certain games all the time. Like, it, I have to be in the mood to play a game, or it has to really captivate me for a long period of time for me to play it again and again and again. Like, Far Cry 3 was a good example of that, both Blood Dragon and the uh, uh, original game. You know, both games are fantastic, they captivated me, they, you know, let me play the game how I wanted to play it. Skyrim is a good example of that, but I, I played Skyrim for like 90 hours or 120 hours or something like that and got burnt down on it, so I didn't feel like recording that one anymore. Um, but that's a different uh, sort of idea behind it. But I mean, I have tons of series that I just haven't finished. And uh, I think YouTube is kind of notorious for that. Or at least for me. I know a lot of other YouTubers that kind of feel the same way where they'll start up a series and then they just won't finish it because either they don't want to play that game anymore or they found another game, you know, there are tons of games out that, you know, you want to play and you don't have time for them all, you know? It's difficult, but it's fun still. Like, I love YouTube. I love what you guys allow me to do. Entertain you guys and, and brighten up your day. I, seriously, I couldn't imagine anything more awesome. Um, and, you know, stuff. But I rant a lot. Positive ranting, though. It's not negative ranting. Um, when it comes to Binding of Isaac episodes. Because there's only so much Binding of Isaac that you can talk to. Talk about, talk about, talk about, talk about. That's what I have to say to that. Um, why are we shooting all these flames? Because you never know if there's going to be like a bomb or something in there. Because we need a bomb for that. Um, Relic, by the way, I believe, I can't remember... If it gives you soul hearts per couple rooms, or if it has a higher chance of dropping soul hearts or something like that. It's a soul heart item, I just can't remember how it works exactly. Um, and it's freaking amazing. I think I've only gotten it like twice. I haven't gotten it very many times. I think I've only gotten it maybe twice. If that. Um, but it is a super helpful item. Especially, yeah, there it is. Especially for... Um, for a character with low health, kind of like this one. I mean, unless you can get some health up items on the first or second boss, then you're then you're kind of okay. But uh, you, you definitely want to get some soul hearts or some balls of steel pills, which I'm hoping this is. Nope, those bombs are key. But that's okay, because we actually have uh, two that we can get. Just a bunch of coins in that one. 
which is a suckish, suckish thing. And we can get this one too for something that I need a key for. That's fantastic. Wonderful news. So yeah, I guess, I don't know. I don't know what happened with the freaking thing last time. The file. It, like, corrupted or something. I have no idea what happened. A key? Nah, those are more bombs or keys, which I don't have any, so we'll just use them just because. Uh, that is a hanger. It's actually a pretty good item, especially if we can just kill these bosses. It's a pretty good item. Not a bad one at all. Whoa! That was close. I think this room gives you two bosses? Pretty sure it only gives you two bosses. Oh, he didn't... Ah, freaking frack. I thought he was gonna jump, and he didn't. He tricked me! He tricked me! Come on, you die now. You got like two or three more shots. Or like seven. That works too. Seven shots, three shots, it's all the same. So the heads can't go on by themselves, nor can the bodies, right? I'm pretty sure that's how it works. Oh, that was weird. He had a glitched one inside of him. He had a glitched one. He did two? What the heck is happening? They all had three pieces, but they only were showing two at a time. That's weird. Oh, uh, okay. So now we're kind of screwed. We have no health. No keys. Oh, it's just stupid. Stupid flies. There we go. That was easy. And we still have no keys, so we kind of have to skip out on that treasure chest, but whatever. And we still have one heart, which is not good. It's not a good thing. Still have no keys, so we can't go in there. What is this game right now? It's it's been trolling me the past like seven times I've played this game within the past week. It's just been trolling me, man. It's not giving me any good stuff. That's so sad. Found the boss room really fast though. Finding the boss room fast is key in any sort of situation. That way you know what direction you need to go. You can do whatever you want. But at least you know what direction to go if you get in trouble, or if you, you know, decide that you're done in that floor, or whatever. So, I mean, it's always a good thing to, to find that boss room. As early as you can. Which we did. Oops. That was almost bad. That would suck if it, like, didn't give me credit for killing those, and I, I reset it. That would be terrible. Oh, any keys? We need some keys. Holy crap. Could really use some keys, game. Key? No. What's in this room? A chest? Let's do it. Let's... We shouldn't have done it. We might be able to get a key. We might be able to get a key to drop. Or we can just do this. Yeah. That wasn't a bad plan. Um. No! Uh, okay, so now we can go into the boss room. And we can just kill this guy because he's super easy. Might as well. Now that I think about it, I probably could have just used uh, the unicorn on. Uh oh, that's not good. That's the second run with, uh, with Judas that I've gotten Krampus. That sucks. Last time I had technology though, and he was pretty easy to take down. Great, you put that on the unit. Oh crap! That's not good. Oh, double crap! It's not good. Triple crap! God dang it, Krampus! What are you doing to me, man? No. Oh my goodness gracious. I seriously hate this boss. It gives you like one second, not even a full second. Oh, and we died! Oh, curse the Labyrinth? I don't think so. Okay. So, 
That sucked. Carpe diem. We're just getting hit by all of them. <laughs> Quad shot for the victory. What am I doing? There we go. Hey, and I got a free bomb. Oops. God bless Americans. There we go. Hey, and we got rid of that fly just by going into that room. That's awesome. And if you didn't notice, we picked up Small Rock, which is a huge damage boost in the beginning of the game. It is probably one of the best things to get on the first floor, other than, like, carry items. Oh, that wasn't smart. Do not walk that close to bombs. They tend to blow up very quickly. This is an easy boss. go that was super easy range up is always a good thing to have a quad shot that way you can just sit on this side of the room and just destroy everything on the other side anything that tends to get in your way you can just blow them it's always a better idea to unlock this for scapular okay I'll take scapular you might as well With the health that we have now, we basically have one free hit. Because uh, Scapular will give you a Soul Heart at half a heart. There we go. And there we go. And we can unlock that chest. Because there's no way that we're going to get enough coins to just get away to the shop. And we can do this. Okay. Now... We can go over here, I think. I'm feeling left. I'm feeling the leftward direction. I was wrong. I was wrong with the leftward direction feelings. Maybe not. Uh, no. Definitely don't need that. If I was Isaac, I could re-roll that with a d6, but I'm not. So we won't. go again. I uh, still can't go into the shop. Well, we could, technically, but it would be a waste. It would be a waste of time. Unless if it's greed, but I don't think greed starts until caves. Two. Oh, we have not enough speed for you, sir. We don't have enough speed for you. Luckily, we killed your time. And we got an angel room. If we can get the relic again, oh, we'll be golden. No, we got Miter though, which is just as good. Turns it has a chance of turning uh, full red hearts into full soul hearts. The only thing that it's not good for is if you have little Chad, it does not work. Because little Chad drops uh, half hearts, and this only turns full red hearts into soul hearts. So it is a useless item with Chad. Little Chad, that is. And we have such low speed, we could really use like a speed up, like the belt. Could use the belt or a speed up pill. Or that, that works too. I'll take that any day. Less than three equals love in my book. That was easy. That was easy. <laughs> Whoever made that up needs to go up. Whoa, careful. Give me that coin. Thank you for that coin. And these guys are super annoying. Oh, careful. There we go. And these guys are just as annoying. I still need to find the treasure room, though. And we have enough bombs to do that. And we got a free bomb out of it. Give me some hearts. That works. 
wish I still had that fool card from the other run. I could use that. Granted, I used it on the other run, but that's besides the point. That is besides the point. Beside the point? Besides. Beside or beside? I don't know. Words and stuff. Grammar is a thing that people do. Bomb, thank you. And kill some flies. Go. Fantastic. Treasure room, that is a terrible item. Uh, I don't even want to freaking pick it up thinking that I like it. No, I don't want to open that. I don't have enough keys or money again. I have enough bombs to get that chest, but. We still. Ah, I don't think I want it. I don't think that I want the chest. If it was a golden chest and I had another key, I would take it, but because I don't have that situation at my freaking front doors and pass up on it. God, we're getting like the same exact bosses that I got on the other run. That is so weird. But again, we had technology on the other run. A uh, run that got corrupted for whatever reason. I don't know why. I had, like I said in the beginning, uh, the Skype call got corrupted. Or, I think corrupted it. So I was in a Skype call, and at the very beginning of the video, I decided to exit that Skype call because I forgot to before I started recording. And it looks like it like just corrupted the file for whatever reason. Like it shouldn't do that. But as soon as it would get there during render, like as soon as it would get to that that part, it would just stop. Like it would stop working. Oh man, I really don't want to run all the way back over there. Nope, we're gonna leave. We technically had enough money to, to go into the shop, but at the same time, then I would have used my key, and then see, now I wouldn't have had a key for this floor. Right off. There we go. Oh, I would have gotten a key anyways. Oh, please be something not that, anything but that. You're so not helpful, Quarter. Just want you to know that. Unless we can get a dark candle. If we can get a dark candle from the shop in here, which is highly, highly doubtful, uh, then I'll be okay. But because this is catacombs, and Reed loves to hide in the catacombs, it's very possible that I will not get anything from the shop and it'll be a freaking greed fight. How did I just get twice? These things just rammed into me. I guess their job. I guess their jobs. Go. All right. Let's see if we can find the shop. Anyways, we'll try and get into the shop and see if it's it's helpful or not. It could not be. Helpful. Who knows anymore? You knows, knows knows. What? I was able to walk over that the first time without getting hurt, and then the second time I get hurt. This game's so trolly. See, no hurt. Completely same direction. As the first time. Same direction, what? That doesn't make sense. Same. Oh my god, this. He just like sat there. No, please! <laughs> Those little. The like spitter things really annoy me. Because I have no idea where their stuff's going. Is that the shop? Yeah. Oh, wow, it's not greed. That's amazing. We will take that, though. Because we're gonna have Polaroid here soon. And we could still use the speed up that the goat hoof gives us, even though it's like really minor speed. Holy crap! What the heck what kind of room is that? There's like 80,000 spiders in there. there we go, grab that key. Oh boy, bunch of spiky rooms. Bunch of spiky rooms. Alright, let's go down. Greed heads? That's fantastic. It's always good news to find greed heads. I don't know how that happened, but okay. Oh, seriously? You're not supposed to be able to hit me if I'm in the middle of your spits. But okay, game. I will take your word for it. This pride is awful. Stupid trolling low bombs. Yay! 
Yay! Oh wow, that's a not a good thing to get there. <laughs> that's that's a part where you really really want Isaac to re-roll that because that's a completely useless item, unless you're you know terrible. Basically, what it does is it gives you one. Seriously, I'm not even going in there. It gives you one heart, um, but nine lives. So you technically have nine hearts, but when you die, you get transported back to the beginning of the room, of the floor. I mean, oh, and this one constantly puts down P. I'm going to die here. I have a feeling. Samson is so difficult. Oh god. Not to mention, like, trying to talk and play this game at the same time is so difficult. You have to be concentrated. Yay! Oh, and then I hit the PA. Picked up the soul heart and then walked into the PP. That's pretty good. And then get hit immediately by a greed head. This game, I don't know. It's been trolling me. Been trolling me. Okay, and a chest. Liberty cap. Uh, I shouldn't have picked that up. Anarchy. Or no, Book of Shadows. We'll take it. We will take this. I'm trying to get another trinket to replace that. Liberty Cap, because I don't like Liberty Cap all that much. It's very, very random, and can either give you really good things or really bad things. Come on, give me one trinket. I have luck down, though. I just remembered. That was stupid. Yeah, we're not going to survive this much longer. This is a pretty fail run. Oh, yeah. Didn't... I... Yeah. <laughs> that was a pretty bad run. We'll, uh, we'll try Samson again another time. But thank you guys very much for watching. Please visit my Twitter at MechJaw at, uh... Twitter.com. I don't know where I was going with that. At MechJaw. Facebook.com slash MechJaw. Twitch.tv slash MechJaw. Um... For all of the followings and things of that nature. Uh, leave a like if you enjoyed the video. I know it's a really short one and a really, really failure run, but hopefully this one renders out correctly and uh, doesn't screw up. So thank you guys very much for watching and have a wonderful day. I'll talk to you all later. Bye -bye -bye.